So you just got yourself a brand new M1 iPad Pro and you are rightfully excited about all the new features. But what about some new useful accessories? Or in this case, a single game changing accessory that I know you guys will appreciate. You see, I have the new M1 iPad Pro and some of the new features that I love are the front facing camera improvements, the addition of the all powerful M1 chipset and my favorite, a Thunderbolt 3 port. There is though one glaring issue, and that is if you want to take full advantage of your iPad Pro and use it as sort of your main go-to mini laptop, you do need access to a variety of ports. So you're probably shopping around for a new docking station that fits your needs. Well, you're in luck because today with me, I have the perfect docking station for your iPad Pro. This dock has this one unique slot, which sets it apart from the rest of the competition, and we will get into that in just a little bit. A quick backstory, I did opt to go with 128 gigabytes of storage on my iPad Pro, particularly because Apple does charge a premium price for additional storage. But the beauty of an iPad Pro is that you can run storage off an external SSD. Now, if you take a look over on Amazon, external SSDs are quite expensive, depending on what storage option you choose to go with. Stay with me here because this will all make sense in just a little bit. I may have a very unique storage solution for you guys that combines both storage and accessible ports. So here with me today, I have this Type-C USB-C docking station. And this hub, my friends, is nothing like you've ever seen before. This is the Acasis high-speed SSD storage and 10-in-1 hub. Yes, this is not a Thunderbolt dock, but that doesn't really matter here because this thing is an absolute game changer. Now, if you've never heard of this company before, that's quite all right. Primarily because they are a newly funded Kickstarter campaign over on Indiegogo. When it comes to Kickstarter campaigns, I am quite hesitant because some of these companies don't really live up to the hype. So after testing out this dock for about three days, I'm genuinely convinced that this is a must-have item for your iPad Pro. So Acasis reached out to me and they asked me if I would like to check out their 10-in-1 USB-C hub. I looked into it and I was quite intrigued with everything this docking station had to offer. So this is what you get when you decide to pick up an Acasis hub. Inside the box, there's one USB-C to USB-C cable and of course to the docking station. Initial impressions, it's pretty compact. It fits well in the palm of my hands and has a very solid build quality to it. It is made out of aluminum alloy and it also has some good weight to it coming in at 145 grams. Over on the bottom, there is some nice grip to it. So if you do place it on a table, this thing is not sliding around anywhere. This is an accessory that I can see myself taking with me anywhere I go. It's a portable docking station that's compatible with not only an iPad, but also an iPhone, a MacBook, or just about any laptop out there. Quite honestly, it has all the necessary ports required to be my main go-to hub, and it even has a power delivery port capable of 100 watts fast charging. The iPad Pro is capped off at 18 watts, so this PD port is more than capable of getting the job done. It definitely helps keeping your iPad fully charged while you are on the go out and about. Right next to the PD port is a Type-C connector, which is going to be used to hook up to our iPad. Over on top, there is a dedicated slot for an SD card and a micro SD card. So if you are like me and you shoot a lot of drone footage, you can easily import those shots now to your iPad at your convenience. What's really cool about this dock is that it can read both your SD card and your micro SD card simultaneously. This is a godsend if you are a creator like myself and you use an iPad for content creation. Right next to the micro SD card slot is an audio jack because for some odd reason, the iPad Pro, meaning that it is a device meant for professionals, doesn't come with one. If there is somebody out there that can explain to me why an iPad Pro does not come with a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack, let me know why down in the comments below. A bit over to the right, we have three ports. One USB-C 3.1 port that can run speeds up to 10 gigabytes per second, along with a USB-A 3.1 port that can also run speeds up to 10 gigabytes per second. And finally, we have a standard USB-A 3.0 port with speeds up to 5 gigabytes per second. Over on the left, there's a dedicated HDMI port. This is perfect for using your iPad hooked up to an external monitor. And then right next to the HDMI port, we have an Ethernet port for those insane direct internet speeds, perfect for playing games like Fortnite. By now, you're probably scratching your head and and saying to yourself, all right, RJ, this is a pretty cool docking station, but what is it about the cases that makes it so unique? Well, I'm glad you asked. You see, if you open up this slot right here, there's actually a dedicated space for NVM Express SSD cards capable of eight terabytes of storage. That is absolutely mind boggling. This dedicated SSD slot has read and write speeds up to 1000 megabytes per second. The Acasis can transfer a 10 gigabyte file in about only 10 seconds, which is about 15 times faster than your traditional HDD. Generally speaking, NVMEs are a lot cheaper than a dedicated external SSD. Also a major advantage of NVMEs is that they are swappable. So if you ever require that 
X Store storage space, simply swap out the old for the new. Inserting an NVMe SSD is super simple. Just open up this casing right here, slide the SSD against the rubber tip and it just simply pops in. Remember earlier when I said I've never seen anything like this before? Well, that is true. Because in the palm of my hands, I have an ultra portable, fully loaded 10-in-1 USB-C hub with a dedicated slot for NVMe's coming in at 145 grams. The NVMe that I'm using is made by Western Digital and this comes with 500 gigabytes of storage. So just a quick recap for you guys in case you are still hesitant on this dock. The Acasis is a 10-in-1 multifunctional hub with 1000 megabytes per second transfer speed, 8 terabytes of external memory, universal compatibility across a multitude of devices, and it has an anti-overheat design. Even when a majority of the ports were occupied, this hub had no issues with overheating. I'll link the Acasis docking station in the description below. You can snatch this for a pretty good discount if you do purchase it using the link below. This video is not sponsored by Acasis. I genuinely do think this docking station is a game changer for your iPad, especially if you do use your iPad as a daily go-to computer like how I do. If you buy this using the affiliate link in the description below, I do get a tiny commission that goes towards supporting the channel. If you did find this video useful, please give this video a thumbs up and consider subscribing to the channel for a lot more iPad related content. As always, thank you guys so much for watching and don't forget to flex with your cases hub.